Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to another LSPDF episode. You guys already know what time it is, man. Sheriff Monday. Man, last week flew by for real. But yeah, it's already Sheriff Monday. I hope you guys are ready for this. And uh, some of you guys did request to use one of my favorite towels, of course. Yes, I, I really call this towel the Christmas light towel because we, we have light on the side, on <laughs> like just everywhere on this towel over here. But, um,. Let's make sure everything is good. Let me show you guys the, the lights. And uh, yeah, man, we can actually get started. We're going to be using ANPL also. And the lights look something like this. Let me know what you guys think. Yes, sir. Take down lights. And uh, let's set up our radar. I hope you guys are having a great Monday, birthday week for me. I can't wait. <laughs> You guys already know how we do, man. But right now, let's let dispatch know that we are available for calls. And if you do have an hour, that, 10, eight. sit back, relax, grab your popcorn, and uh, let's do some LSPDFR, man. We've got an officer requiring Traffic assistance. Traffic back up already. East Joshua Road. All right, let's go. Respond, code two. All right, so we are heading over there, code two, guys. Um, let's see what's going on. What officer need help to? I mean, some officers usually don't feel safe with a traffic stop, and you know they will just request for help. And also, I am using the older version again, so I'm I'm just I'm just grateful to be able to use these now. Why did the officer do the traffic stop over here? Kind of wish I could get this guy to move. Oh, I accidentally canceled a traffic stop. All right. Wait, now I gotta reinitiate the traffic stop because I cancel it by mistake. I don't know what's the reason they stopped that person though. Alright, let's get a plate check. I guess let's take over the traffic stop. That was my fault. The guy has light on. Suspect's license plate. Nice. Cruz. Lincoln, Paul, John, All right, on our license suspended. King. Traffic felony. I knew they had a reason, just didn't cautious. know what was the reason, but it was my fault. I was trying to make the other vehicle move, and uh, I end up canceling his traffic stop. But um, hopefully, it's not going to be a glitch. Let me see if I can actually coach for his call. All right, dispatch, I'm taking over the traffic stop. Um, 10 4, copy that. Code yep. 4. All right, so I get a chance to take over the traffic stop, and I'm going to pull this person over again. I kind of have to pull them over again. All right, come on, pull it over. And you see, we released the um, officer. Okay, driver, can you pull over to the right, please? All the way to the right. Get off. Get off the road. All right, right here is fine. All right, guys, we already know we got a suspended license, so let's approach. Man, this Tahoe's on point. I mean, I know this is an older Tahoe, but this thing never get old for me, like for real. All right, let's approach them. All right, hello, ma'am. How you doing? License, registration, and proof of insurance, please. And we can actually smell alcohol coming from her, guys. All right, Miss Cruz, what's going on? I know it's a nice Monday. Have you been drinking by any chance? You show up as an eagle. No alcohol. Ain't okay. All right. Drugs. Anything that you know about? All right, Miss uh, Miss Cruz. The uh, you know you driving on a suspended license? Oh, you so you know. All right. All right, sit tight for me. I'll be right back. They just not drinking. We'll see. All right, so guys, we're gonna run her license, making sure everything is good. Um, let's see. Jessica Cruz, her license is suspended. Looks like she says she needs to go to work. All right, so guys. I could let the license suspended slide because it's always on the officer. I mean, it's always like on the officer discretion or whatever. But we cannot let the alcohol slide. If she's really drinking, she can't drive. She's going to jail. So that's what I'm saying. Like, I'm not gonna go just by the by the suspended license. All right, ma'am, can you, can you shut down the engine for me, please? Thank you. Uh, can you step out the vehicle for me, please? All right, now for my safety, Miss Cruz, for my safety and your safety, I'm just going to pet Wait you down, second, making sure buddy. you don't have any weapons on you. So just turn around and keep your hands up, please. Miss Cruz, Miss Cruz, come on. Miss Cruz. Oh, my goodness. Miss Cruz, we're going to run away from me now. All right. 
Not only that, she is resisting too. All right, Miss Cruz, I don't want to tase you. Can you just stop? Can you just stop, please? Oh, Miss Cruz tripping. Oh, she's going to jump over the wall. No, 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 no. Not today, Miss Cruz. Oh, shoot, I missed. Yo. Miss Cruz, you cannot outrun me. Like, come on, stop. Now get up, get up, and put your hands Don't up. You move. You just made this worse for you. Oh, Miss Cruz. Please don't. You are better than this. I'm. I was trying to be better than this until you decided to run. I was gonna let you slide. Oh, Unless God. you was drinking for real. All right, what you had on you? You feel like you had to run. All right, we're just gonna pat her down. Slurring her speech. Yeah, she, we're just gonna pat her down. Rusty spoon. I don't really. That was not a good reason to really run. We have 415 in Sandy Shores. Respond. Code in three. Sandy? All right. Um, We'll put ourselves available for that, too, guys. But I just gotta do the paperwork. You gotta do the paperwork real quick. Wait, what is it? Potential. Oh, it's right there too. All right, so they might have found some stuff. So you guys already know. Anything that I can't say, I mean, can't really say on YouTube like that. We're gonna call it stuff. I think some of you guys, the OG subscribers, know what I'm talking about. Stuff. <laughs> All right, let's search the vehicle real quick. All right, Miss Cruz, uh, I've been driving under the influence. All right, nothing, nothing serious. Oh, I still have to prove that she's under the influence. So let's breathalyze her real quick. All right, Miss Cruz, can you get out? I mean, I'm gonna get out. <laughs> All right, just like I said, we're gonna breathalyze her. So guys, with these older version, you guys get a chance to see like I had almost all the tools. Like this is why they want to restart. Look, you see that the breathalyzer? I got that. Like just everything. All right, let's get a unit over here. She's at a hundred percent drunk. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. All right, dispatch. Can I get a unit to my location, please? Sandy Shores. All right. In the meantime, Miss Cruz, I gotta do your paperwork. We might have a, a stuff down the block, so we're gonna try to hurry up. Th that unit can actually wait for now. Yeah, wait. Um, let me do the paperwork real quick. Hey, how you gonna stop in the middle of the street, though, man? All right, Miss Cruz. Number one thing, she was driving on a suspended license, driving under the influence, and also, um, basically not just evading but resisting. This thing arrests. Um, we didn't find a possession. Us other than the rusty spoon, I'm gonna disregard that. Just like I said, I was gonna let her slide until she did that. Um, yeah, I think that's about it. And she ran away from me. And uh, other than driving, other than the influence and suspense. Yeah, I think that's about it. But we do have some stuff to take care of. All right, dude. Um, can you take it for me, please? Assistance required. Come on, man. We already assigned you. Sandy Shores. All right, guys. Um, where I'm going to right now? I hope we make it. I hope we make it. It might be the end of the episode. <laughs> Shit, <dude. laughs> All right. Ah, oh, come on, train. All right. You know what? We'll cross through down there. All right. So I'm gonna have to call some backup unit for this one. Can't do this by myself. I did answer the call though. Oh, they already got units over there. Okay, let's go. Well, they already got a bunch of units here. All right, so we here. Did they find it on the train track? All right, let's make contact. Wait, I'm not. I'm not. That's okay. You know what? It is what it is. Let's find out. Who's the officer in charge, man? I mean, deputy in charge. Oh, she is. All right, what's going on? Uh, what's the situation? We found a bag near the train tracks. Uh, we don't know if anything dangerous, but I don't want to take any chances. Okay, um, robot is already in position. 
You can't control it as soon as you want. Press the left mouse click. Oh, this is pretty cool. Oh, nah, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I, I don't remember this call, but um, remote control. That's pretty cool, guys. All right, so I get to control it. Oh. All right, so we're going toward the back. It looks so weird because I don't have all the stuff, but you guys understand. <laughs> it's not really me. All right, let's destroy the back. Oh, no, not control robot. Oh, shoot. I just messed up. Oh, that's pretty cool. Need to stop saying that. Bro, it goes so much faster. All right. We just got it. Oh, not when the train is. Oh, shoot. Come on, train. Pass by quickly. Pass by quickly. Code four. No further that was oh, that was a good call. That was a good call. I'm not gonna say cool anymore. <laughs> that was a good call, but um, yeah, back to it. I think this this is from regular call out. It's been a while since we had these, but um, yeah, it was supposed to be the robot, not me, just cruising like that. But you guys understand? All right, but enough with that. Let's go. Let's do this. Assistance required. Suspicious vehicle. All right. Uh, caller say uh, a middle aged man is driving around in what? Nah, bro. Okay. Uh, since they going down this way, are they moving? Yeah, they moving down this way. We'll meet them down down there. You know, sometimes you don't have to follow the GPS. Oh my. All right. So what we got to do is really stop him. Find out what, what what is he up to? Like, what are you doing, bro? He's driving pretty fast. Probably trying to get out of town or trying to get back this way. Yep. He took the exit. No, he didn't take the exit. All right. So he's driving away. He's driving code two right now, guys. Just trying to get there as fast as we can. Come on. And uh, as I was saying too, guys, um, I know some of you guys like to get your LSPF to be this stable. There's a lot of stuff that I have to disable, uh, especially from like traffic police and stuff like that. I'm I mostly disable everything just to make sure the game is running, unless like I have a call out that that I want to come through. I don't. I disable almost everything else. This guy's driving fast. He's really trying to get out of town. My towel is not that fast, so we're gonna try our best. Maybe I'm gonna have to speed up with this towel a little bit more. But we catching up though slowly. I'm doing about what ninety six. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? That's not him. Is he in the minivan? I think it's the minivan. Yep, that's our suspect right there. Um with the Weasel News van. Almost out of my jurisdiction, but we got him. I mean, kind of out of my jurisdiction for sure. All right, I was going to play check. I want to come from. What we got here? Target vehicle license plate. Seven, Mary, Nora, Frank, two, eight, three, Tom, no, ten, ninety nine. All right, Tony Allen does have a clean license. Let's approach him. All right, hello, how you doing, sir? Hey there, bud. I gotta call someone driving suspiciously and talking to, you know. Oh shoot. Oh sorry, for sir, is not what you think. I am just looking for my daughter. I was supposed to pick her up after school, but I couldn't find her, so I talked to the girl because I thought. Oh, okay. I don't know, man. All right. Let me check that real quick. All right, I check his profile. He's married and has a daughter, so I think he's saying the truth. Okay. 
All right, I guess that works, man. All right, man. Just like I say, uh, I get out of here, man. Catch you later. All right, false alarm, guys. False alarm. Looks like they say he has um he has a wife and daughter. All right, dispatch. Show me code four on that call. Clear code four. No further units required. Uh, people tend to do that a lot too, man. Believe it or not. I had somebody personally. Let me try to turn around. Trying to head back now. Thank you. Yeah, I had somebody personally call the police on me because um I remember um uh, so when it comes to like my job, I have to park somewhere and then go into the office or park somewhere and uh you know do what I have to do. So there's certain neighborhood that I had to park. And uh, when I used to work for like Chase and stuff like that, so people would just call 911 and just like, "Hey, I see a suspicious vehicle, bro." I'm like, "It's a minivan," but the only good thing that they had it was a white minivan, and uh, we didn't have no no sign. Like the company was being so cheap, though, bro. It, we didn't have no sign. It's just a white Dodge Caravan. Can you imagine? A uh, just a white Dodge Caravan. And I usually have to park it locally so I could go by the banks and you know stuff like that. Man, one time, bro, I walked back to like a bunch of cops surrounding the van. I'm like, bro, I work like yo. I have to prove everything. All right, on um, Pacific Bluff. Yeah, nah. I'm gonna have to coach for that one. Person trying to jump from a building to a, what? All right, dispatch. Pass this to somebody else, please. We are code four. No further units required. Yeah, we're not going. Roger that. Code four. Yeah. So one time, I walked back to my vehicle, surrounded by cops. Um, and you know, I just cooperate, did what I had to do. Somebody behind me with no license. All right, let's let them pass. If you see an officer do that, this is good luck. <laughs> oh man. Bro, I swear I know when I'm gonna get pulled over, but it'd be for like the weirdest thing. Weirdest thing, man. All right, let's pull. Let's pull him over. All right, so he doesn't have a license, guys. That's why I'm pulling this guy over right now. My EMP off did ring that. Let's approach him. Let's find out what's going on. We're gonna approach him on the other side. All right. Hey, what's up, buddy? Um, license registration approval insurance, please. Kifla. All right, Miss uh, Adam, right? All right, Adam. Uh, any reason why you? I mean, I'm not sure if your license is suspended or whatever it is. It's showing no license. Like, why are you driving without without license? You might not even have a light. All right, you know what? Sit sit tight for me. I'll be right back, man. I don't know. It's showing no license. Um, I don't know if the vehicle's registered to him too. So let's let's check. Just want to confirm all the paperwork. This my this would be a simple stop. Yeah, this guy don't even have a license, bro. How do you even get a chance to register the car? Yeah, so he doesn't have a license at all. Um, what I'm gonna do is take the vehicle. His license is not suspended. I'm not gonna arrest him or anything like that. But he's driving without a license. Just like I said, those calls, uh, those traffic stop are based on the officer's discretion, of course. Um, let me see. That do do you even have a ticket for no license? Yeah, driving without a license. Yes. All right. So we got him. All right. Only one thing. I'm I'm not going to let him drive out of here. All right, man. Um, can we have you step out the vehicle for me, please? All right, grab whatever you need from this vehicle right now because you are not driving away with it. I don't know if you got to go to work or whatever. You better call that Uber. Here's your citation. And don't let me catch you driving without a license again, man. Get get your license, bro. Go do the paperwork, all of that, and take your driving tests. Is that the same way they do? They get a license now, bro. I heard they were heading. Um, I remember during like the pandemic and stuff like that. It was so easy to get a license. I was like, yo, man, I failed my test three times. Man, bro, I felt I failed the driving test three times, guys. Can you guys imagine that? It was over the, the most simplest mistakes too. Um, uh, you know, actually, I'll get you. I'll get you in Uber, man. 
Oh, I gotta update this on iPhone. <laughs> Yo, buddy, how much you? All right, we already got the vehicle um tow. We give him a citation. Is your Uber, buddy? Yeah. So just like I say, I felt my driver. Um, the written test easy ace that, but for some reason, um, I always had an instructor that was like extremely mean. Oh, uh, he's not taking the Uber. I guess he's gonna walk it. Maybe he's by his job. Let me just hit this U-turn, please. Thank you. Get him back to my jurisdiction. All right. So yeah. Um, just like I say, I did fell it. Ugh, we gonna let him slide. Just like I say, I'm running ANPR. And dispatch, show me a uh, code for that traffic Roger stop. That, code four. Show me back uh, 10, 10 8, please. Four, 10, 8. Yeah, so the first time. We've got assault with a deadly weapon. Whoa. In Wait, where is it? Oh, is that Richmond? Oh, don't tell me that glitch is happening again. Where I cannot answer the call because I canceled the last call. All right, so we're going to request another call to see if I can actually answer calls. So this is a glitch. It happened from time to time. All right, dispatch. Let me see. Another call. If I can't answer it. Oh, okay. It was not glitch. <laughs> I could, I just couldn't answer that call. A report of a fire and possible. Explosion. Whoa, whoa. We are heading there. All right, so we are heading to that location, and we'll see how everything's gonna turn out. Yeah. So, uh, man, the first was it the first time or the second time? So it's it's two times that I, I kind of like really fell it. The first the first time I think it was um, for parking and I, I think I touched the sidewalk a little bit. And then the second time I drove into a two way thinking there was a one way. And then uh, you know how New York does it. And I was driving in the middle of the road and then a bunch of cars start coming at me. I'm like, oh, shoot. Yep. I definitely felt this. All right. So we're going to a lab right now. Where is the lab? Oh, okay. Okay, we got the lab. We got the lab. Um, uh, dispatch, can I get some units? Some more units over here, please. I do see um two people running away from the scene. We do have casualty, of course. All right, I do see two people running away. Oh, uh, I do see a weapon too. They do have a weapon. They do have weapons. Uh, dispatch, can we get air support, please? Units requesting helicopter support over the Alamo Sea. Oh, they're running for their life. Ma'am, stop! Stop, police officer! Stop! Oh, oh, I show up to. You see, this is why I always have my gun. Suspect is down. Suspect is down. Suspect number one is down. All right, other suspect is running for it. As you guys can see, everybody's chasing him. Oh, he is swimming, bro. Um, where's where's the boat unit? Where is the boat unit? Yes, whoa, 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 whoa! Was he pointing his gun? I hope not. Yes, he's trying to shoot. He opened fire on us. We did what we had to do, man. All right, swimming with the. F okay, um, let's get let's get ambulance over here. Ambulance. Oh, I can actually hover. The LMOC. Man, I I don't know if I was an officer too. I think I would just go for a swim. Just like I mean, I would would you chase the suspect if they go for a swim? I would. I mean I would. Only thing is, can you imagine? Alright, we got the weapon. I don't know how would I feel. Uh, but most of you guys did say most officers do have a backup um uniform. So how you doing? How y'all doing, man? Oh, okay. Oh, I remember this glitch. It still happened over here. Man, this bro, this bro, this breaking back memories for real. All right, man. Y'all do your thing, man. Grab, get this guy. All right, the other lady need help too. We did have an explosion over there, so the firefighters probably taking care of that. Let me host my weapon now. Yeah, man. So just like I said, we did what we had to do. But yeah, that's how I didn't get my license on the first. And you know, the second try, I already bought a car and everything. It was like so embarrassing, bro. <laughs> it was so embarrassing. I was like, come on. 
Oh well, I mean, it was not really me that bought the car. It was really gifted, but you know, you know how it is. All right, wait, where's the lady? Shooter. Oh, okay, I guess she's gone with the car. Unless she's down there somewhere. I guess she's gone with the car. Um, the firefighters are still here. Yes, they are. All right. Uh, can we get? I guess they probably try to help these guys. Ambulance. I'm trying to get additional paramedic over here. Sandy Shores. There we had um two casualties so far. We have a motor vehicle accident on uh, Alamosi. East Joshua Road. All right. There's enough of you guys here, man. I am out of here. I gotta call. You guys take care of this. Hey man, I did what I had to do. All right, my backup. I'm just gonna clear them, and uh, I gotta go. Hey, wait, what are they doing? Oh, uh, probably just some. Um, I mean, he did the right thing, though. He did the right thing. All right, so one thing that I um. I feel like anybody should do. If your vehicle is disabled, either push it or get it off the road. Cause I watched man, I watched this person last time. Eight Frank Edward Zebra Nine. He doesn't have Lincoln, a traffic violation. Yeah, I watched this person just stop in the middle of the highway. Like I'm like, bro, you could have just like, yo, believe it or not, there are some people that was willing to help with certain things, and there are some people that are not. But man, you'd be surprised. You find somebody helping you. A stranger helping you. Hello, sir. We got a call for a vehicle accident. Is everything all right? Yeah, I'm fine. This car down on me for the third time, and uh, I can't fix fix that thing. Did you call uh, a mechanic to take a look at it? No, I left my phone at home. All right, I got you, buddy. We get we get somebody over here. And right, the tow truck is on the way. But yeah, you'd be surprised, especially if you come across somebody like me. I'm pretty sure there's always somebody like me out there where I would take take out my time and uh, help you out. Like I'll uh, help somebody um change the tire. Like I don't understand. If you drive, you should know how to change your tires, bro. Like for real. I think that should be mandatory. I think that should be like on a test or something. Unless like you an older person or uh, or uh, you know somebody that just can't do it, but. Wait, wait, wait. What, what, is, what is he doing? Oh yeah, I remember this. I remember this. All right, dude, 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 just hook, hook the thing, and get this going. Good day, y'all. Finish the officer so I can actually hook up the car. Yeah, do that, man. Is he just walking away? Yeah. I don't even bother checking his license. I mean, he's having a, a hard day already, man. No insurance. I'm not even gonna cite him for that. Um, the tow truck is gonna figure this out. Um, they both walking away. Hey, Hashtag, you guys didn't see that. All right, guys. So I'm trying to go on this side. Actually, let's put ourselves available now. This is bad. Show me ten eight. Roger that ten eight. And let's see what we can actually get into, man. I hope you guys been enjoying Sheriff Monday. You guys already know how we do, man. Every Monday, if you haven't caught like the last couple of Sheriff. We got a lot of episodes to catch up with, and each one of them are over an hour, <laughs> or at least an hour. I remember I used to do Sheriff Monday like 30 minutes. Uh, you guys let me know if an hour is too much, too. Because there's this time that we try to like lower it, and then there's time where an hour is an hour. That's it. We've been enjoying an hour Sheriff Monday, though, man. And uh, the paperwork just require all that, too. So that's the main reason why I do yeah. that. An officer requiring assistance. Traffic stop on assistance. Route okay. 68. Units respond code two. Never let me go down this way, man. All right, so uh, Grand Snow Desert. Is he on the highway? Alva's not a bad spot. Like they always sit at at a bad spot. Is it by? Oh, okay. It's by the um prison. So we should be good. Okay, siren. All right, we just gotta hit a Yui, and we should be all set. Why did he stop in the middle of the road? All 
All right, picture town. Yeah, at least I'm not going to cancel his traffic stop again. All right, what's going on, man? Can you tell me what happened? Uh, glad you arrived so quickly. Of course, what's happening, man? I saw this person driving quite erratically. Um, I want to back up in case they try anything funny. All right, sure. Go ahead. I'll cover you. Actually, could you go first? I'm the oh, these guys. All right, I got you. Why is this thing? Sh what? What is going on with this dude? All right, what's going on, man? Uh, license, registration, and approval insurance, please. Get All right, uh, Ronaldo, what's going on, man? All right, Ronaldo, have you have you done anything recently? You've been clean for a year. Okay, you sure about that? Drinking anything that you know about? Oh, okay, now we talking. All right, man. Um, my partner back there say you've been driving recklessly, man. What's going on? All right. Anyway, sit tight for me. I'll be right back. All right, guys. I think he might be under the influence. Dude, at least you could just stand up there with me. He's back up, man. Why am I even back up right now? But he caught a good one though, because I feel like he's under the influence. Plus, his license have been expired for over 289 days. Um, vehicle doesn't belong to him. It belongs to Marco, but it's not stolen or anything like that. But um, we'll get him out. Marco do have an, a, an arrest warrant for possession of burglary tools. But um, maybe that's why I rang up on the other officer. Um, I guess NPR. I was just turning that off. All right, so let's approach him. I mean, let's get him out of the vehicle. All right, buddy, can we have you um, shut down the engine, please? All right, and also, can we have you step out, please? I'll back up. All right, now for my safety and your safety, I'm just gonna pat you down, making sure you don't have any weapons. Wow. You're not on the arrest or anything like that. I, this is for my safety and your safety. All right, turn around, and keep your hands up, please. Oh, that was a glitch. The screen just went dark. All right. Um. Hey, man. Question for you too. Like, why? Um. Why your eyes so red, man? Oh yeah, dirt in your eyes. Okay. All right. All right. All right so we're gonna run some field sobriety tests. I feel like you're under the influence, just like you say. You had a shot, but I feel like you not. You might not be okay to drive right now. So um let's let's get let's get somewhere safe right now. Come on, follow me. I think right here should be good. Not on the dirt though. Alright, right here. Alright, you can actually stop following me now. Alright, so oh, oh, sorry I'm holding my gun. Um which, what I need you to do is walk in a straight line for me. Once you get up there by the back wheel of your vehicle, turn around and come right back to me, all right? Let's go. Go ahead. All right, right there. Right there you can turn around now. All right, my dude's drunk, man. I mean, not drunk, but I don't know. He's under the influence of something. All right, so sir, you just failed the first test. You know that. All right, can you stand on one leg for me, count from one one thousand to ten one thousand? Go ahead. You go. Oh shoot! All right, he's running. He's running. Dispatch, we have a runner. Come on. Hands up, man. Put your hands up. Don't do this. Now get on the ground. Dude, get on the ground, man. Stop playing with me. Don't get on the ground. No, nah, I'm fucking begging you, man. Bro, bro, you want to get tased again? All right. Dude, tripping, man. And why this guy just standing there, not doing anything? I don't think that guy deserves his job, man. All right, what, you, what were you under the, under the influence of? Yo, whatever car that was, you guys heard that? But oh, that actually sounded nice though. I don't know. I don't know what it was. Thanks. But it sounded good. 
Oh, he haven't been drinking. I guess he, he just had some stuff. Appreciate it. All right. Yeah, my dude was under the influence. Um, one of the main reason why he is uh, going to jail right now. I have a seat. Oh, this is my arrest now. This guy tripping. He could he could go home. I right, dispatch shows code four. Roger that. Code four. I knew he was gonna step out. That's so why I want to make sure that I put him back in. Right, come on, have a seat back here. Yeah, this is my arrest. Yeah, let's search the vehicle and uh, then we can actually get out of here. I shouldn't make that guy transport him. <laughs> too late now. Oh my goodness. All right, we got him on possession too. We have a 415 in uh, grape seed. Units respond, code two. All right. I took that. Let's get a unit over here. Assistance and I got to do the paperwork real quick. You know, we got to do everything fast, man. All right, we got him on possession. Just like you guys say, um, when it's possession like that. Oh, shoot. I'll make sure. Um. All right, I just want to make sure it's the right stuff. I hope I didn't. Ch I'm not charging him with the wrong thing. All right, so we uh, man, this guy's walling yo. That's the first counts. Just like you guys say, when it's uh, a briefcase, let's just charge him six sound. And then uh, we got him for driving under the influence, resisting arrest. And uh thanks for a license disregard all that. Um where are they? Are they around me already? Okay. Yep, they're right there. Did they send back the same guy? No no no, it was uh, a different dude. The same um they driving the same car. Alright, gotta go. We got a police impersonator, guys. Believe it or not, this is something that still happened today. Where some people think they are the police, or oh, they act like the police, and uh, yeah, they they trying to. I mean, you'd be surprised. You'd be surprised. I remember the uh, not a couple months. I think it was last year, where there were they, there was an alert for people not to pull over for this. Um, I think it was this either black crown fake or something like that. You got to make sure you check the vehicle, and I don't pull over for any cop cars unless I know, like I know. What department is from? Like, I mean, by now, most people should know what each unit from the area look like, or at least. But um, yeah, sometimes you get people like that, man. I remember one time um, this uh, camera was trying to pull me over. I'm like, what? Get out of here. And then they got off. I'm like, yeah, I knew, I knew it was fake. I knew it was fake, bro. Come on, man. This Camry with these two fake lights. I'm like, yeah, who do who they think they pranking right now? I didn't stop. They they didn't even have a PA mic, so I already knew. I was like, yeah, man, get out of here with that. All right. So I'm guessing that's the person that got pulled over, maybe. All right, we got a police impersonator, but I don't know why I'm here to meet this guy. I guess this guy probably got pulled over by them. All right, what's going on, man? Hello, officer. We got several um, calls of someone using private vehicle with siren to play cops in this area. Okay, I organized this vehicle. Could you take it around um, the area and see if he fell um, for bait and pull you over? Pretty clever. I see if I can act, I can attract him. Thanks. I'll hold the position and check if he drives around this block. Good luck. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I'm gonna call all these calls. That's pretty cool now. All right, so search for the impersonator. Oh, okay, that sounds good. That's the old. That's the old um 
that's one of those uh, challenger I had. I remember when the Lexus used to look like that. So he's gonna try to pull me over if I drive around here somewhere. I don't see him yet. So we're gonna bait him, guys. So I'm supposed to drive around these areas. I don't see him yet. Oh, there they go. There they go. There they go. There they go. They trying to pull me over now. <laughs> you don't realize you just pull over. Oh man, it was such a good call, but it crashed. All right, it is what it is, guys. All right, so guys, I had to reload. I'm not sure if he's still in the vehicle, but um, let's get a backup unit over here. Cause he's he's fully tented out. We'll see if we can actually get him out the vehicle. That was a that was a good call, but um, it crashed for me. All right, we got a unit right behind him. All right, let's get him out. If he's still in a vehicle, though. All right, get out of vehicle with your hands up. Get out of vehicle with your hands up. Put your hands up, buddy. Put your hands up. Anybody else with you? Try to pull another on. cop over. <laughs> Today's not your lucky day, buddy. Today's definitely not your lucky day. <laughs> that was a good call, though. All right, any weapons on you? Anything that can stab me, poke me, anything like that? And you guys can see I caught my backup first. He didn't even have a gun, bro. All right, dispatch, can I get an ID check on the Felix Ras Rasicot? Oh man, okay. He was not supposed to be driving. Plus he got his uh, warrant for his arrest. All right. Oh, I can't switch this vehicle. All right, it is what it is. Let's get a tow truck over here for it though. Yep, that's gonna be evidence. All right, I'll, I'll do. Um, I don't have my unit with me to do the paperwork. Can I just do the paperwork in your unit, real quick, man? I'll be quick. I think I lost my unit, but um, unless the lights still save it, I'm actually gonna, I'm actually gonna drive back over there. All right, so as you guys can see, yeah. All right, um, suspended license. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, so there was a warrant for his arrest. Uh, impersonated a, poli a peace or police officer. And also, um, come on. This thing, I feel like I'm using somebody else's computer and it's not working well with me. All right, so I think that's about it. I can't get out this unit. Oh, okay, there you go. All right, man. Um, let me get back to this car. It's so crazy how, how there's so many rules that you have to follow when it comes to like LSPFR to not crash it too. So that's what that's what we have to work with. Um, all right, dude. Uh, you can actually take him away. That's gonna be your arrest, man. Thank you again. How are you doing? All right, so let me. I try to go back and find our car. 
Since I have ELS on, most likely it might still be back there. That was a nice call he gave me too, man. All right, yep, there we go. I see my car back there. Hey, man. He definitely helped me out. All right, dude. Here's your call back. Appreciate, appreciate it, man. I was able to catch this dude. But other than that, thank you, bro. That was a nice car you're driving there. I could tell you probably rebuilt the engine on that. Man, that was pretty cool though. But too bad it, it crashed on me. I guess next time I get it, I gotta figure out what what caused the crash. All right, bro. All right, guys. Uh, yeah, back at it. Let's see what we can actually get into. Oh man. I don't know why I still like. Attention, all units. We've got a suspicious vehicle. In Grande Senora Desert. Let's go find out what's going on. Respond to the scene and clear the vehicle from the roadway. Okay. Might just left a vehicle, I guess, somewhere down there. And I was trying to head back that way too, so that's a good thing. All right, so we are heading that way, and uh, we'll see how everything is going to turn out. The Benin vehicle. That BMW, I was just talking about that BMW. That BMW happened to be one of my favorite M5. I knew I do like the new M5, but that M5 right there hit different once you have the right exhaust on it. And uh, I never got a chance to put an exhaust, but I, I mean, I wish I did. <laughs> this right here, this this M5. As you guys can see, it drive around. You guys might realize, like, I, I do have some of my old cars in the game. And just you know, just for me to remember, I I had those, and you know I, I miss them sometimes, especially the M5. Uh, we do have a vehicle. Whoa, 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 whoa! What are you doing? Oh, I could switch the taser. I got time. All right, stop, stop. All right, now put your hands up and drop that knife, man. Drop that knife. Drop the knife. He got out of his vehicle and coming straight at me, man. All right, we got the knife. I'm not even gonna, man. I I have no choice but to. All right, any other weapons on you? Anything that can stab me, poke me, anything like that, man. Yeah, I have no choice but to, guys. We're gonna charge him with that knife. All right, powder residue, pepper spray. Don't really care for that, and use Nita. All right. Come on, man. You gonna have a seat, seat Stephen Miller. Why did that name sound familiar? Even Miller. Who do I know that's named Steven? Is that a star or something like that? I don't know. That name sound really familiar. You guys let me know. Do you guys know somebody by the name of Steven Miller? Let me know. I mean, I know some Stevens, but Steven Miller. All right. Let's get a tow truck. Nothing illegal in there. Tow truck. All right. So we're going to test the stuff that we found on them. And uh, we're gonna charge this dude. All right, just the powder residue, I guess. And a temp, uh, I don't know. Which well, should, should we get? I, I would say assault. He probably was just trying to stab me, but you know, we could. We probably would have died right there too. He had the motive. I mean, he did assault. I mean, he didn't get a chance to get to me. But if that knife got anywhere close to me, you know he would have stabbed me. So basically, I'm gonna charge him with a temp for sure. All right, so Stephen Miller, we got possession of that stuff, and also uh, I guess a temp. If he got anywhere close to me and stabbed me, bro, I won't be here right now. All right, so dispatch, can I get a transport to my location, please? Assistance required. In Grande Senora Desert. Oh, picture time! Perfect time for picture time. This area is always this area always look nice, though. All right, come on, man. Y'all taking your sweet time. All right, but um, man, since this thing crashed so many times today, just like I said, I'm using an older version, but I'm using so many callouts. Now we have callouts that have so many calls to the point where you don't really need that much callouts in. You could have an episode with just one call out or two. Like back in the days, I remember having at least maybe five to even ten callouts. 
like different callouts, which uh, sometimes would conflict. So right now I'm using multiple callouts. Let me see. I should be able to pull it up as you guys can see. I'm using country call out, uh, cut your eyes, um, my call out, regular call out, traffic police is just my regular and other CFO is my regular. But as you guys can see right now, I'm using one, two, three, four. I just removed one because of the last crash. Actually, two because of the last crash, but we should be down to two soon. But anyway, back to patrolling. Dispatch, show me code phone that last ten call. Four, code four. And uh, show me back 10 8. I'm not a Roger that, 10 8. All right, let's run the MPR again. And uh, we'll see. What's going on around here, man. I like patrolling around here because. Uh, it's away from like Sandy in a way, <laughs> and we barely get a chance to really patrol around here. All right, but I hope you guys are having a great Monday. It's birthday week for me. I've been oh, well, oh okay, that was a glitch. That was a glitch. I was about to say, yo, did somebody just crash up there? All units, we've got a possible disturbance. They always get me to move, Rogers, man. All right, let's hit a U turn. Oh, it's right here though. It's right here. Okay. I thought it was going to be like right there by the jail or something like that. Head to the location and find out how can we help. Dude's at the gas station. Oh, don't walk away now. Yes, my Zoom. What do you want now? Oh, now he's walking away. I mean, I could just disregard. Hey, buddy. Buddy. Buddy, hold on for a second, man. Hey, hey. Wow, hold up. All right, do you have any idea on you, sir? Get I'm not going to search you or anything Thanks. like that. I'm, I'm happy you move. All right, Claude Speed. I'm just going to check his ID, guys. If nothing don't come up, I'm going to just let him be. All right, Claude. Have at it, man. Have a nice day. All right. Off you wait, go. wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, what's going on? Oh, shoot. We got to. We got it. She was trying to break into that car and uh Wow. Wow, now I gotta chase her. Attempt robbery. Nice try, lady. That's my taser. Come here. You didn't see there was a cop right there? Stop! Alright, now get up. Get up and put your hands up. I didn't see there was a cop right there. I almost didn't see her though. I was gonna look in the car. But uh, I guess she broke the window and realized there was a cop right there and decided to run away. Was it the Prius? All right, ma'am. Do you have any weapons on you? Anything that can stab me, poke me, anything like that? All right. We don't care about that. Let's uh, dispatch. Should we code phone that last call? All right. Come on. Uh, Miss Collins, Miranda Collins. All right, she was trying to steal the car, most likely of uh, the person in the charger. She probably broke the windows, though. Let's see. Let's see what we got. Okay, she was trying to steal the um the SUV. Are right, you broke the window though, and then you just left. All units. Security detail requiring assistance. In, uh, this patch. Uh, I'm busy right now. Humane labs. Yeah, ten I'm, four I'm ten busy right six. Now. All right, ma'am. Have a seat. It's just like I said, man. We did what we had to do today. All right. All right. So most likely, um, I'm just wondering how does officer like I I feel like I have an idea, but if you're a real officer, definitely let me know. I know we gotta do some paperwork on like you know reporting this. Not really calling the insurance, but since the window's broken, do you just leave the vehicle here or do you tow it? Let me know. Well, let's call the insurance company in the game. We call call the, We can actually call the insurance company to pick it up. But um, and to, uh, or do you just leave the vehicle until the person get back to it? Like somebody just broke into it. You guys, let me know. I kind of feel like I don't know how to really complete this call the proper way, or at least the real life version. But right now we got this lady on attempt. Um, I guess attempt robbery or grand theft. We saw her commit the crime. Oh, and she had a warrant for arrest. All right, so we have warrant for arrest. And uh, 
Do they have a, a temp? I would just say carjacking. Yeah, carjacking it is. All right, let's get somebody. And she was resisting, but I'm gonna let her slide on that. Let's get our transport. Assistance required. In, uh, we got some paperwork to do today. Okay, okay. I mean, some uh, court cases to go to. I know officers hate uh, going to court. <laughs> I think that would have been like the least thing that I like about being an officer, uh, if I, if I ever was an officer. It's um, going to court, man. Court dates. How you doing? Because everything that um you charge somebody with, you have to prove it. And you guys already know, it's always what you can actually prove in court. All right, we good. This bad. Show me code four. Ten four. Copy that. Code four. All right. Uh, let's get back to ten eight. Ten four. Ten eight. Wait, am I out of time? I don't even know if I'm out of time or not. Um, I guess let's say one more call, guys, and then I think that's it. All units. A traffic alert. Oh shoot! All right, we got a traffic accident. Grande Senora Desert. Oh, it's down there. All right, we got a traffic accident. Investigate the traffic accident and determine who's at fault. Okay, let's go. Man, I've seen some of the worst accident. All right, for real. Let's go, let's go. Let's hurry up. Oh, I haven't done first person for the people that love first person, so. Actually, I owe you guys a first person episode. Which I need to do. I will soon. Now, when it comes to like accident like that, the faster you get there, there's a possibility that you might be able to save somebody's life. So that's why I'm trying to hurry up and get there. The gauge doesn't work properly, as you can see. Oh, I mean, it kind of. Vehicle just this is another one that just looked weird. All right, so we're here. All right, three car crash. Um, oh, some of yo, yo, why are you running? This crash, can I get some units over here, please? One of them decided to run. Sir, stop. Roger. We're heading over now. At least we already know who's at fault now. Sir, stop. I see the perp. We're in Let me the hurry perp. up before I get run over by the train. No. Come on, hurry up, hurry up, man. I ain't trying to do this right now. Is the train coming? I hope not. Get on the ground, man. Get on the ground. Hurry up, hurry up. Bro, I hope the train is not coming. Oh, shoot. I hear it. No, I don't. Dripping, right? <laughs> yo, watching both sides. All right, yo, move out the way, man. Okay, thank you. You move him out the way, but we still gotta go. All right, this guy was under that Florence. We got the cause of accident. Even though it might not be, but it's, it's up to us to investigate in a way. But this guy seems suspicious already because as soon as we show up to the scene, he ran, and we might have people that didn't make it. All right. Do you have any? Um. Actually, let's get paramedic over here. Ambulance assistance needed on Joshua Road. Got two of them. Oh man, you might be going to jail for a while. All right, let's search him too. Let's make sure he doesn't have any weapons. But we do know he's he is under that influence. I mean, we have sign that he might be under that influence. So possibly. All right. So we found possession so far. Turn around, Jake. Come on, let's go. Rapido, rapido. Appreciate it. All right, he was not driving. Um, he wasn't drinking, but Shocking. still doesn't prove anything yet. Yo, dude, can you stop walking into the dude? Thanks. I'm trying to arrest him. So, okay, driving under the influence, guys. Like I got to say, this guy uh, is going to jail. Um. Let me put him in my vehicle. This guy's really trying to like take him. Attention all units. A traffic alert on uh, Marina Drive. 
Dispatch, I'm busy. And just like I said, this is gonna be my last call. Alright, you can't take him out of my vehicle, man. That my unit going off? Oh, it's these guys. Yo, turn off the siren, bro. Alright, one made it, one did not. Just like I said, this guy is going to jail. Alright, dispatch, can we get corner over here, please? Alright. Just like I said, we did arrest him. Um, let's search his vehicle. Okay. Um. All right. A bottle of morphine too. Let's get a tow truck for the first vehicle. We got corner on the way. Tow truck. That person did make it. Let's just get a tow truck for the vehicle. Like I said, they were just involved in a car accident. I don't have to search a car or anything like that. Tow truck. Assistance needed. And this person did not make it at all. Tow truck. All right, sis. Uh, since this is going to be my last call, why not? I'll take this guy. Uh, dispatch, do sure it's code 4. Dude, do you not. I mean, this is my arrest, bro. Oh, this is my arrest. Like, get away, bro. You really know what it is. I don't think they're gonna let it, let me check. Yeah. All right. Attention, all units. We've got dispatch. I'm not available. Joshua <laughs> Road. All right, ten guys. Four, ten, last paperwork. Six. Last paperwork. Jay West over here. Um, uh, driving under the influence. Not leaving the scene. I mean. I would say reckless driving too. Oh, uh, actually leaving the scene of an accident since he was trying to get out and uh, also resisting and also possession of um, that stuff. Where was it? Okay, so that's one and not pills, but control substance. Let's just say that and. Uh, Vehicle of manslaughter, which is man, this thing happened all the time. Because we do have somebody that did not make it, of course. All right. On that note, we are heading back to the station. This guy really following us? Yo, is he serious? Bro, go back to your unit. <laughs> He's really just following us. It is what it is, man. All right, so guys, we're gonna bring this guy back to the station. I'll do the paperwork, and uh, I hope you guys are having a great Monday. I'm def, I think I'm over my time now, definitely over the time. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys had an hour, chill with us for about an hour or so. And uh, yeah, man, I think this is it. Every Monday, if you are new to this, we do this every Monday. Come back next time. <laughs> Is when we do like the real paperwork, and I know a lot of officers that actually watch this too. Definitely shout out to y'all. That is why I always ask. I'm always asking for like the for some pointers on certain things, of course. And if an officer always, I mean, if you want to come through, I mean, you pull up to my house. You want to try this for one day? Definitely let me know, man. We're gonna pass them over. Definitely let me know. I would love to see an officer. I've been trying to get officers to do this. Because, I mean, yes, I cannot do their job, but I want to see them play LSPFR and see <laughs> how many mistakes or, you know, how things work and stuff like that. But right now, let's do the paperwork and, uh, yeah, paperwork. We're going to court. All right. So, Jessica Cruz, what happened to Jessica? No prison time, just some fines. Um, Adam, just a fine. Ronaldo, got about eight years. And another year. Okay, so it got about nine years and ten months. Uh, Felix, was that the impersonator? Yeah, it was. Got about a year and six months. Stephen Miller, forty-five years, bro, for that knife attempt. Collins, four years, and Jay West, got about fifteen years. All right, guys. So on that note, you guys let me know where I was wrong, where I was right. You know, all of the above. But right now, um. We're checking out, man. I hope you guys did enjoy this. Uh, and thank you for taking 
you know, an hour or five minutes. I don't know how long you watch this video for. Whatever time. Thank you for taking that time out of your day to even watch this. But I appreciate you. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. I'll catch you guys next time, man. Peace.